nothing especially mysterious about a glass of water. 10,000 trillion or so water molecules vibrating like crazy, dancing around on the smallest of scales, but contained by the walls of the glass, a little bit of gravity and some hydrogen bonding. It fits our expectations about the universe very nicely. And there's nothing surprising about watching a drop of ink swirl and spread through the liquid, dissipating from a cloud of color to an even hue. It's just the way we expect things to go. If we drip that drop a hundred, a thousand, or a million times, we'd not only expect to see the same thing happen, the same thing would happen. Probably. Thing is, there's nothing about the laws of physics that govern how all those molecules move around that prevents the whole thing from running in reverse. Then what makes this moment any different from the past? We know that today is different from yesterday, but why? Well, physicists say that the universe tends toward disorder. A great arrow of time points toward a future in which entropy is greater than it was in the past. Probably. This is the second law of thermodynamics. It's not a law like Newton's gravity, it's a law of probability. Flip a coin a million times and will you ever get a million heads? No. But could you? Sure. There's no law of mathematics that says it can't happen. There's just so many more ways for it not to happen. We may get 10 heads in a row, or maybe even 100 along the way, but it all evens out over time. That's the reason bombs don't unexplode. It's the reason we have water falls and not water ups. The reason today is different from yesterday and tomorrow will be different than today is that since the very beginning, since the Big Bang itself, everything has been getting messier. We know that entropy increases. We know that time moves in one direction. Probably. But why was the universe ever ordered to begin with? Why is it 13.7 billion years ago, the universe could flip a coin a million heads in a row? We don't know. It's one of the great unsolved mysteries in physics. When we solve it, we'll finally have an answer for one of the strangest questions in science. It's strange because we already intuitively know the answer. The universe fits our expectations because our expectations were written by the universe. Will we ever solve the mystery of order? Who knows? But tomorrow's another day, different from all the rest and full of surprises. Probably. Stay curious. The science behind these things, how wood burns, how airflow works, if you start thinking about fluid dynamics inside of a cooker, start thinking about all these other things, then yeah, science has a pretty huge part of it.